Hello, my dear viewers. How are you doing today? It's time for that nightly read, y'all. I was actually in the middle of working on the Zodiacs because I'll be uploading them on Monday. But I only have this weekend to like work on them because I'll be off this weekend. So, But you still going to have to follow the schedule. So, you just got to be... Plus, I want to get them all done. I'm not, I know I'm not going to get them all done tonight. I'd be cheating just pick a few up and then like wait the next day for other ones, you know? We must be cordial in this bitch. Anyway, hope y'all are doing just wonderful and fine who we're reading for. Um, someone who's crazy and needs to get out of their head. Someone just, just went bonkers and just is like, you know, like, I need to get out of this headspace, you know? Completely just woman scorned, uh, very um, bitter, closed off, not really trying to express anything either that that isn't like, I don't know, bitchy. That's, the bitchy is a good way of putting that, so that's what we're looking at. Hope you all are doing well, you know. Hopefully y'all are able to get a new start as this person wants to get, you know. Anyone new to my channel? If you're looking for a personal read, all the info is down in the description box below. First readings on the house, of course. I do take tips and donations. Thank you very kindly. And I want to thank everybody for watching, viewing, subscribing, and following me here and everywhere else. You guys are wonderful. Mwah. Love y'all's faces, okay? Okay, let's see what's up with our current querent today. Remember, y'all, if it resonates with you, good deal. If not, don't worry about it, it's just a card game. Yeah. It only works if you believe in it, right? So just boop your nose and away we go. Two of Pentacles. Someone's got some options on what they want to do. Ooh. When it comes to a Queen of Wands reverse, Sagittarius Leo Aries. She's having a fit. Total bitch mode right now. She is just aggravated and all over the floor okay um the thoughts and feelings right here is the ten of wands reverse someone feels like that there is a burden they can't let go of or it's not like getting any lighter at this point in time the the root of that is uh the da 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 if i could talk today the root of that is the death card reverse scorpio energy right like things aren't dying a person isn't changing their ways stuff like that right we got the Seven of Pentacles right here. Mm. Someone trying to plant a flower in the desert. That might have not have been the best judgment call. Or they're trying not to resurrect something that they planted seeds into, too. Judgment cards are reversed right here. And then we got the world. Ew. That's a lead up. Shit's coming together. New cycles are beginning for this clearance. Okay, let's see. What's the vibration right here? The sun could be Leo. Look at that. Brightness, being in sync with oneself, that higher self energy. And being happy. Alright, let's see y'all. So this card's got some options when dealing with the Queen of Wands reverse. They feel very burdened and like they need to release this stuff, but nothing's really changing for them or they're not changing their ways in order for that to happen. Now... They are trying to plant some seeds, but it's like they, it's either they don't want to resurrect something or try to fix something, or it, something was a bad idea and it caused the cycle to like closing a new one to be started. I just crossed my legs, damn it. Okay. This Two of Pentacles right here, we got the Page of Swords. Could be Aquarius, Libra, Gemini captivation entrance someone might be very much intent on finding some information out doing a little spy work because um they don't feel like the past was very fair when it came to bounties and shit they didn't get their rewards or whatever and now they're very curious about what it is they're actually supposed to get but unfortunately they're wasting time not actually like bringing them themselves up so it's kind of like um you know they're worried about money that they didn't get but it's like they could have had, like, money of their own if they would have done something. You know, that person who doesn't want to put the work in almost, I feel like. It's like you're trying to figure out what you're going to do with that person. 
Queen of Wands right here, Leo Sag Aries. Very impatient. She's even got a posse with her, and they're all just like dramatic as hell with their arms up, screaming and shit, right? Um, she doesn't have a lot of knowledge or insight when it comes with whatever it is, it's her problem. Oh, she has no idea about the past. How traumatic it was, and what choices had to be made. Like, they're all cryptic mysteries that still aren't solved yet. It's like she has no idea about what happened back in the day. Interesting way to look at it. Let's see. Let's clarify this to a pentacle scenario. Let's see. Someone made some manifestation. Right? And they they manifested someone not doing anything, not moving forward, not taking action. Knight of Wands could be Aries, also Leo or Sag. Um, slow moving offer. Like someone even manipulated uh, like a fire sign to stick around for a potential offer or an offer that's good. It's slow moving though. Like what? Like I don't understand. It's like he doesn't want to move so he can wait for this dude to catch up to him and be like, Whoa, yeah, I'll wait for you, dude, but it's only because he came in with some cash. You know, one of those friends, right, who only want to stick around you because you can pay for anything and everything. And it's like, you, you purposely slow down so you can round the corner and run away from them before they catch you. <laughs> okay. Um, Queen of Wands reverse right here. What is her problem? Solemn patient and shit, right? She feels like things aren't turning in her favor. The devil's on top of the wheel, stopping it. Yeah, okay, definitely cannot move forward. Feels like they're fighting an endless fight. Or at least a useless fight, you know? It's four, but I'll take them, whatever. It's like they want to have a good time, but they got commitments to worry about too. But there are still things that are unknown. Strange parent. Hmm. Ten of wands reverse in the thoughts and feelings. Like a burden will not end. Um, something's gonna exceed or surpass whatever with the eight of wands. Like a snap of an alligator's jaw. Uh, that might be an illusion. Delusions. Craziness. The moon right here. Pisces or Cancer. And that bad judgment call. Somebody isn't going to get resurrected with the judgment card. Hmm. And that's over here, too. This is a very strange one, y'all. I'm not sure what to make heads or tails of it. Death reverse. The root of the feelings, right? Oh, someone had a bad judgment call about how things would change. They were under some delusions about how things would change. Okay, never mind, never mind. I think I got it now. Let's see. Um, things that won't change, or things that aren't changing, or a person isn't changing. There's no turmoil or disorder. It is not existent right now. I get the King of Swords, Mastery and Domination. Someone's got control of themselves and, like, got their eye on that prize. And... Page of Coins. Someone's, like, taking a run. Expression, message, like she's taken off somewhere. Let's go ahead and like lay out for the sun. That way I can pick up all the cards together. Uh, the sun, someone wants their happiness. But they don't have a treasure. Or there's nothing to discover. And someone's charisma and spellbinding nature is not serving them very well. They just want to be happy. They want to be emotionally fulfilled. I feel like... Like, they want to be emotionally fulfilled, but they don't have any real... 
mm, how can I say this? I don't want to say it's just about money. It's more like it's the security or, you know, finding, like, you know, that get rich quick kind of thing, right? And it's like starting to wear them a little bit thin. Just a little bit. All right. So the Ten of Wands up here, reversed. Well, that is going to be coming to an end, so no worries about that. But all the other issues right here about the lunacy and the bad judgment. Um, they're going to be released from that mindset. Okay, okay. But they're still not going to know exactly what to do, is Quirant. Now we got death reversed down this way. We're... I'm not sure about this one, honestly. It's like, there's no turmoil. There's no disorder. It's like someone's keeping a keen eye on, like, this page of koi. This king of swords is this, like, master or whatever, right? There's a lot of, like, regrets that seem to be coming up. About how there is no fighting. And how everything went down the tubes. What? Okay. Like, was somebody expecting somebody to fight them? Like, they're sad that, like, there wasn't any sort of, like, argument or, like... I'm gonna, like, talk shit to you right now, you know? Like, just starting some craziness like that, you know? It's like, someone wanted dramatic, somebody wanted something to happen... Hmm. Strange, really. Alrighty. The sun over here, once again, could be Leo involved in this. Someone feels like they gotta really restrict themselves in order not to be a loser or have an enemy in their house. You know that feeling, you know. In order to keep feeling secure. Is this this crazy song? Okay, I gotta turn this. Okay, we just rewinded it back. We're not going to the crazy anime Gundam Man music. Not today, Satan. <laughs> Alright, Seven of Wands, or not Seven of Wands, Seven of Pentacles. Someone wants to plant a flower in the desert and see if that shit'll work to their favor. <sighs> You know, you tried. It, it, something probably didn't work out financially. It didn't lead to, like, a great start. And there needs to be a recovery from it. Um, just let your guard down. Because you're probably just going to need to be, like, unconfuse yourself. Take deep breaths. Try to relax and let your brain recover from it. And then, like, you should be able to, um, I would think, find a way of dealing with it a little bit. But that's just my advice. You can just go tell me the stuff if that's what you feel like doing. No judgment. Speaking of judgment, we got judgment reverse over here. That was a really good segue. I'm kind of proud of myself. <laughs> okay, we got the King of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Six of Wands, reverse once again, and the Queen of Wands. Victory archetype, they are not. We got a king of cups and then a queen of wands. She theorizes, she calculates. He's a diviner and sager. Or just sage. Um, I almost want to say there's no victory between the two of them. Or at least he didn't get a victory with her. You know, now he's feeling all trapped and confined and shit. Okay, so the world, right? Things coming to a close, and now a new cycle might be starting. Yeah, the Queen of Cups, counterparts of the King of Cups, Shamer, Sh uh, Shaman, Enchanter, going on a fool's journey to be a wanderer, explorer, start with a clean slate, in order to have success and rule. Ooh, ooh, look at that. So yeah, this is kind of a good ending. But it is kind of confusing... I feel like whoever this queer is is like um like not like they're terrible or anything like that. It has nothing to do with that. It's more along the lines of like Ooh. 
Mmm. It is almost like... Like, there's no victory between the two of them at all. Neither of them are victors. Um, but I don't think he was... I, like, I almost feel like whoever this parent was is just... They at least wanted someone to fight for him, I think. Like, make me feel like I was actually worth something to you, damn it. That kind of thing, right? Yeah, they wanted that happy ending, after all. Or someone was looking for that happy ending. Uh, trying to get that wish fulfillment with it as well. But they had the guard up! You know, they're still keeping their guard up about that. Like, even if it came up, like, it's just kind of like... He, okay, if this person was still wondering about a wish, trying to come out dazed and confused, if that wish fulfillment came up to them and it actually did have happiness behind it, they would be too paranoid to take it. It would be like, this is like really easy. Is this a trick? Is this a trap? Seriously, is this a trap? And then you're just like, no, this is seriously for you. No, this is a trap, isn't it? Yeah, both nines right there along with the ten. Right? Someone did some sneaky shit, and now there's a little bit of confusion about what to do. So someone definitely needs to listen to their intuition about how to handle that shit. Or maybe someone's hoping that, like, the high priestess doesn't know about the sneaky shit. Which, you know... I mean, like, that's like Pisces energy. That's all about secrets and, like, mysteries and shit. Something can be worked on and successfully, I feel like. It's just gonna require someone getting over their spilt milk or whatever, right? In order to get back to this kind of lover scenario or have this connection. This isn't actually a bad reading. It's just kind of like, you know. Hmm. It's almost like even if someone leaves somebody, like. Just because they didn't find another person? It's like, yeah, this cups were spilled, and maybe this had something to do with work, too. Right? But it feels like... After these cups are spilled, this person does get on the fuck- Get the fuck over at bridge with these two cups, and boom, they land up with a soulmate. So, wow, look at that, y'all. That's actually rather sweet. Like, it, 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 like, it started off kind of weird, but, like, it was kind of sweet. I'm, like, I'm kind of happy that this one is a happy ending. You know, that makes me sleep a little better at night. <laughs> anyway. Okay, I'm done. Okay, now I'm definitely done. I'm sorry. Anyway, that was the reading, y'all. If you enjoyed this, please like, share, and subscribe. I would appreciate it as much as you. It's up to you, though. No pressure, of course. But uh, I will see you guys later. Toodles. Love yous. Bye-bye.